In this video, we are going to learn how to search Scopus database. We are going to use Boolean operator and truncation tool to search the database. To get relevant results, always start with your assignment title or research topic. For this demonstration, we are going to find resources for the topic. To what extent have recent initiative to increase the number of people who travel to work by bicycle been successful? Look at the title and identify the key concept in the title. For this example, the key concepts are initiatives, travel to work and bicycle. These key concepts are very helpful in finding the relevant search results. We can use these key words to construct our search terms. Try to find synonyms or similar or related words to your key concepts. In this example, you can see the key concept initiatives can be mentioned as initiative in singular form or initiatives in plural form. When we think of other terms which are related to our search topic initiatives for traveling to work on bicycle, we are also interested in tax incentives or tax benefit related to that. So we can add the phrase tax incentives in our search. Similarly, to travel to work can be also stated as commute or commuting and other words for bicycle are cycle, cycling, bikes and bicycles. Truncation or stimming is used to expand research by retrieving the potential variations of a keyword that use the same root or stem. Truncation is represented with asterisk. In this example, the word initiative with asterisk will pull all the information which has word initiative, initiatives, both singular and plural, and similarly commute with asterisk will get all the articles which has the term commute, commuting, or commuter. If you need to find the exact phrase, it needs to be in the quotation mark. In this example, I want to find resources which has term tax incentives. So put the word in the quotes for exact phrase search. So now we have got the key concept. Let's use the related terms and combine them with Boolean operator or. As you can see, initiatives by using the truncation, we have put asterisk here and we can we want articles which has the term initiative or incentives or tax incentives. Similarly, for bicycle, we want articles with cycle or bike or bicycle. We also want to combine these different words with same meanings or related concepts to combine to form a search string. So we are going to use the Boolean operator and Let's go, go to Scopus database and do the search. Go to UQ library. Select database from the drop down menu. Type in Scopus and do the search. The first key concept is initiative with the truncation or incentive with the truncation or the phrase tax incentive in a quote. Add search field. The Boolean operator and will automatically be added. You can select other Boolean operators from the drop down menu. But for this demonstration, we are going to use the Boolean operator and. The next key concept is commute. So commute with the truncation. The last key term is bicycle. So cycle with asterisk or bike with asterisk or bicycle with the truncation. Go to search and you get 76 document results. So you'll find all different articles related to those key concepts. To further narrow down your search, on to your left, you can use the filter. So for example, if you want articles from the last say 5 years, click on the desired year 
if you want a particular document type say for example we are just going to have look at articles so click on articles and conference papers and limit it to those two filters so we get 35 document results from out of 76 now all these articles they are from last five years so op to open the article click on the title of the article and you can see the key concepts are highlighted in the article you can also have a look at the related documents here so similar documents similar results so you can go on to these articles for more information